Hey, hey, what is up everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Time Traveler. And it's been, it's been a very long time since the last episode, but today I want to work on this little area over here. Um, first things first, I'm going to need to expand this at least one block either direction. And then after that, what I want to do is I want to have a storage system, like a fairly big one for all the mob drops over here. And it's going to be like sorted and stuff. Yeah, I want to have quite a large system there to sort it all. Um, and then after that, we can continue building up the mob system, I guess. And the system, the sorting system will actually be good. Right, got this all dug out. Uh, now, I need to know how many blocks long this is. Uh, I think I'm going to count from that wall over to this block here and then I'm going to try to find the midpoint and then I'm going to try to build a storage system on this side and then on this side I want something else but I'm not quite sure yet but if I look over over here if I can make it yeah um, there's a gap there and I want something cool there with that gap and have glass and stuff and natural light I think that would be pretty cool uh, so, let me count. Alright, so I found the midpoint here, and I'm gonna dig, I think, four blocks in, and what I'm gonna do with that is I'm going to have chests on this third block there, or the fourth block I mean, and then there's gonna be a three block space for me to walk around and stuff, uh, and this should be alright, I think. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to make it out of wood, or the floor at least, it's going to be out of wood. Uh, not quite sure what everything else will be made out of. Uh, I'll just put a torch here to show you that's the middle for now. And it's turning night time, but good thing I'm working indoors today so I don't need to take a break. Uh, let me just collect some of these things though. Lots of skeletons, okay. Okay, nothing blew up. <laughs> that scared me a bit. Okay, let's get on with work. Okay, so I've got a little bit of an area dug out here. Room for four different sections of chests. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to store feathers with the other mob drops, normal mob drops, um, because they're pretty useless to be honest. Um, and what I want is to have a chest here, a chest over here, and a chest over here like I have in my other storage system downstairs and in between that I am going to um, have some kind of accent block maybe wood and then the rest of it like the floor is actually not going to be wood it's going to be something else I'm thinking um, and I want to try use um, wooden stairs in the middle here to separate stuff just like so, um, and then of course normal blocks in between and on the wall here, and then there's going to be chests, and then I'm going to have kind of some kind of block over there. Um, I definitely don't want it to be stone because that's pretty boring, uh, and that's gonna this wood accent is going to stretch all the way to over here and stuff. I think. I don't know, I'll have to play around with it, I think. But I'm thinking this will work pretty well. Right, so I got the chests in. Uh, this is quite a few chests, and I actually want to try something real quick. Um, there are no ways to get a sign onto a chest because shift clicking doesn't work, I don't think, yet. Um, but let's try anyway. So, if I do that, it doesn't work. But if I do this. Ah, okay, that doesn't work either. Never mind, um, thought it would. We can place signs there, I think that's pretty cool actually. Um, yeah, that could work. And we can have the arrows pointing in different directions. Cool, cool. Um, I'm thinking for the ceiling we're gonna do what we did over there with the stone slabs. Uh, that, that could work. 
And for the floor here, I'm thinking have grass spread from over there to over here. That, that could be pretty cool, although the sound of walking grass is kind of not so nice. So maybe not. Um, I think, I think sandstone exists. So maybe sandstone here actually. I don't know, this is going to be such a big mess in the entire base because it's just like so many different blocks set everywhere. Such different color palettes. Um, let's see, let's see. Uh, sand. Does sandstone exist? It does, okay. Uh, well, I would need to collect some sand first. And while I'm here, let me drop off some more stuff. Okay. I will definitely need those signs. All right, let's let's go add the signs in. Um, right. I am definitely gonna want to put them on the stairs here, actually. So let's have let's have uh, let's have them like so. Gunpowder. Uh, bones, and then we're gonna do that. Okay, that works. That works. And then we're gonna have something like this bones, and then we're gonna have arrows. And then finally, we're gonna have arrows what was the other drop yes yeah, string string cool so that's our sorting done basically and we're probably gonna fill from the bottom up that makes quite a bit of sense to me there's a lot of stuff there okay good uh, and I want to have crafting table right over here actually so let me break this one and put that one there actually you know what? have a crafting table in each one that that would be cool crafting in this version sucks right crafting tables um i forget what's the texture underneath them well, let me just make a new one because I'm going to need one anyway. That is the texture underneath them. Okay. So nothing special. It's the same as wooden planks. Um, yeah, so I have crafting tables here. Uh, not sure what block to put here. I'm thinking having stairs facing that way. Let's try that real quick. Get a stack of wood. We don't need this many stairs, but let's make them anyway. To have, I guess. Yeah, I think that could work. That definitely works. Um, oh, and then we can remove these blocks. Have stairs like so. Yeah, I like that. I really like that actually. So let's try this again. Uh, we're going to need a couple more stairs. And let's repeat that over here. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I quite like that actually. Uh, we can't click on the chests from here because stairs are still a full block until quite a bit later into the release actually. I think 1.3 or even further actually in the release. So that, that's going to be out of this world by then because we're gonna switch worlds when we get finished with beta. Uh, I need to sort this thing out with spiders because they they don't go off by themselves and it's actually causing some problems. Um, but yeah, I, I like this. We want some kind of bright block so I'm thinking snow for the sides actually as well like we did over there. Uh, in which case we'll probably get rid of these borders here. Ooh, that, that was a bit too much. So 
So we'd get rid of that and then we'd maybe carry on this pattern over here actually like this going down the whole thing. I think that would be pretty cool. Um, and yeah, I guess I'm going to go collect some snow uh, and make this into stone slabs over here like I did over there. And I'll need to think of something for the floor. I'll try sandstone in like a few blocks, but I don't want to waste too many blocks on that. I'm going to collect snow over up on the mountain because I'm going to need to get rid of it there anyway. For other builds, doing parkour without being able to sprint. Let's try this. Oh, what a master. Right, and I have a spare shovel, that's good. Realistically, I could just make a bunch of stone shovels and you know what? I will because I have a lot of stone and I don't want to waste my iron shovels. Okay, I'm so smart. Let's make sticks. Okay. And I'll be back after I collect the snow. Okay, and with that, the wall and the ceiling is done. Now, just need to do the floor. I really quite like this idea of using the stairs to make kind of like a natural path in the middle. Uh, but I want to have some kind of accent block on the outside here. So I'm going to need to play around with a few things. I think maybe this is where the sandstone can come in, actually. Um, so I'll dig this out and I'll play around with it. Okay, so having the stairs didn't work, but it looks like having the wood like this does work, and I'm fairly happy with it. I guess another thing I could have tried was having the stairs pointing inwards here, so there would be a dip in the middle. But I don't, I don't think that would have looked very good, honestly. So I just went with this, and I'm gonna carry this over as far as I can. And over here, I'm gonna probably just put wood as well. Actually, yeah, I'm, I'm, I like this. I like this for sure. Alright, so I didn't quite have enough resources to get it all the way to the end here, but that's alright because I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do over here anyway. And I didn't do this wall over here because I'm not sure what I'm doing here either. But, as you can see I've got the storage all nice and sorted now. Um, got my gunpowder here, got the bones here, uh, arrows I'll actually take some out, and got the string here, and the feathers we really don't need, might as well just throw them out. Yeah, um, in this version, you can't you can't shift click onto things, they'll just open them. So the way that you would, say, put torches there is you just put a torch there and do that. Or onto a chest even, just like that. It's pretty cool. Um, so, wait, can I do that? No, you can't place them onto stairs. Okay, good to know, good to know. Um, but yeah, uh, I am thinking that we should maybe think of what's going to go there and also definitely move this portal somewhere i want to move it underground actually uh, so maybe let's go find an appropriate place for that in our basement um fall down here okay so this is our basement type thing what i'm going to do in the future here is i'm going to have a bigger storage room over here for like cobblestone and stuff uh, and dirt because we get a lot of cobblestone because we live in a mountain and we have to hollow it out and stuff but I really want to put my ball down here so it's not noisy all the time and and I'm gonna I'm thinking I'm gonna put it over here in line with the mob system 
So let's just move all of this. I'm, I'm going to want it to be a few blocks in this direction, probably. Yeah, maybe there, like so. Okay, this will be where the portal goes. And let's move it right now. I'm going to go get my diamond pick and break the portal upstairs. And it's all going to be good. Yeah. Okay, do that. And let me go get the the obsidian. Okay, so that was maybe the most painful experience ever. Now that that took like five minutes to break. Um, but yeah, we got we got the obsidian. Uh, I'm gonna grab the flint and steel, and I'm gonna pop down here. Awesome. And let's rebuild it. And let's try not mess anything up. Cool. And there we have the nether portal again. Uh, let's just go through, see where we end up, see if it's the same place. Yeah, same place. Cool. And of course, this place is just as dark as I remember it, so let's get out of here. Because this place really sucks. Okay, cool. And while we're down here, I'm just going to store some of my uh, cobblestone because I really don't need it. Upstairs, it's just clogging up the entire system. And just like so, we freed up our inventory for once. Alright, so I, I don't know how long the episode has been, but I'm going to be ending it here now. Uh, because I kind of ran out of time to do more stuff. Um, and... Yeah, I'm quite happy with the progress. Uh, I think I think this looks really good, actually, this path here. I love the accent, and I like the bright wall, and I like the polished ceiling. And this storage system was obviously needed for when this is better. Okay, nothing's going to fall on top of us. Good, good. Um, I still need to sort this out, of course, but that's for some other time. And yeah, uh, thank you for watching everybody, if you like be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more, leave a comment for any suggestions for what to do next, and as always I'll see you in the next one, have a good day, bye bye.